Hello and welcome to the final collective worship of 2020, our final Advent collective worship. We've nearly finished our Advent calendars, we've wrapped the gifts we're going to give and we've put up our Christmas decorations. We are ready and prepared for the big day, or at least we're nearly there. And this is what Advent is all about, not just preparing for the day when Jesus was born, but actually preparing for a hope that is to come. Let's have our final Christmas carol from my friend, Danny. Christmas is all about 
hope. I remember being a kid, I would get the Argos catalogue and I would circle all the things that I wanted. We'd also write Christmas lists, send them off as letters to Santa. As a child, I would wait in anticipation to see if my wish had come true. This year, I'm excited for a very different reason because I'm counting down the days until I can travel to see my family again. Hope. Hope is when we're looking forward to something. But this year, for a lot of people, has caused them to lose hope. A lot has happened to make that the case. But hope, hope is what keeps us going. Hope is what helps us get through the tough times. Hope makes us stronger. And while we might not get all we want, we have something to hope for. Pause the video for a moment and discuss the following questions. Where does your hope come from? Jesus was born in a time and place of suffering. He was born in Israel during a time of foreign occupation by the Roman Empire. He was born into a poor family. In his early life, he became a refugee. And yet, just as the angels who came to the astonished shepherds shone glorious light in a dark night, likewise, Christ's birth brings light into our dark time to bring hope to us. Jesus promised that he will return to bring light and life to all who hope in him. Pause now and reflect on what gives you hope. Father God, thank you for hope. Thank you that in the darkest time and in the happiest times, we can cling to hope. Help us to be hopeful this Christmas time and always. Amen. Christmas is nearly here. And at the end of this week, we have our Christmas service. But until then, here is this week's challenge. Choose hope. When everything around you seems at its worst, choose hope. When things are at their best, and you're starting to think, when is this gonna go wrong? Choose hope. Choose hope, always. And for our final try praying task, ask God to help you to be hopeful. Merry Christmas. See you soon.